I just want to say about my eye. You're going to see without, throughout the video that I have like a red spot in my eye. I broke a blood vessel. So that is the reason why my eye looks like that. There's nothing wrong with it. I must have scratched it. Maybe took off my makeup too rough. But that's the reason for my eye looking at that. Nothing to worry about. It's healing. It's like a week later. And it looks 10 times better. But I didn't want to scare anyone with my red eye in the video. And not talk about why it's like that. <laughs> Today we are going to Lancaster, PA. Lancaster. 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 It's he says Lancaster, like three different words, but growing up I always said Lancaster. I had a speech impediment, let me be. So we are going there today. My aunt and uncle do live there, so we've been there before, but not like downtown Lancaster, so that's what we're excited to do. We're gonna go to the Central Market, maybe get to pick up some honey. Some honey! <laughs> I don't know what they have. <laughs> then we're gonna walk around the Art Gallery Row, Vintage Shop. So I hope you guys enjoy and let's do a two hour drive. You can tell we're in Lancaster now. <laughs> we're finally here. It took like two and a half hours longer. There was so much traffic. Look how much traffic there still is. But it's okay. Found street parking. And now we're heading into Central Market. Because actually, what does it taste like? Like sea salt caramel. Ooh, we got an empanada. As well, as soon as we walk in, we got two things. So it's a spice, this is a spicy salt and then a beef and cheese with green olives empanada. I love empanadas. Is it good? Oh, yeah. upstairs because we got a sandwich but look how cool we get overview of the entire market this looks like it was like an old farm or like a warehouse or something we got a grilled cheese i don't know what was in that i think it's i know there's brie and mushroom and i think truffle oil pepper red pepper flake nice little cheese bowl it's so good i can't wait to bite into that i'm not really a mushroom guy since dating her i became a mushroom guy before i hated mushrooms oh. <laughs> that was good. We might have bought this as well. It's her favorite type of muffin, or one of her favorites. It's cranberry orange walnut. Oh, I'm just taking a bite. Oh my god. Oh yeah. Mm. That's not dry. Oh, I love cranberry. Oh, let me just go pay. I'll run back and pay. Don't be, oh, this is the place, but like, if we would have came here in the morning, I would have said. finished up at the market. We were there for two hours. It didn't feel like it though when I was inside, but it was warm in there, so it felt fast. good. But now we're gonna walk back down. Queen Street. We're going to the vintage shop, then the art gallery and all that stuff.
Oh, you know what to pass your bone. I want it to fit like a jacket, like a pier. Oh. Uh. You know you're gonna get a new shirt by the time we go back, right? finished walking around the shops and now we're gonna go to the art gallery but we called for dinner to see about reservations and all that stuff and they said they don't it's first come first serve but right now it's an hour wait and it's only four, four. so we're either gonna go there early or hopefully it dies down the time we'll call at like 4 30 5 ish <laughs> Record store, and I saw this. The only thing that caught my eye, I was excited about, was this original song from Disney Films, The Music of Disney. It's a, it's a CD set, and my car takes CD, and I haven't had CDs, but all these songs and three different CDs. I'm actually gonna play them when we leave. I'm gonna play, I know. I'm gonna play this too. This yeah. two is more like movies, it was like our childhood, but this three is park songs from the so ride. This is a bunch of like, I'm assuming behind the scenes of like the, the, films, the films and the films movies, like, why the songs like are from. Music inspired. So cool. and That's a cool coffee book, to be honest. Yeah. The three CDs. I like just like Mickey playing the piano. This is funny. It's I know. Three to set. Three That's so CDs. cute. He got for fifteen dollars, so I guess five dollars a CD is pretty good. Look how cute this is. He said this smells like a smoker. Come on. This looks like, well, it reminds me of Nantucket. He's never been there, but it does. Like, that's so cute. And that sweater he also tried on. He liked that one, too. We're back in the car now. It's pretty chilly out. So we think how we bundled and everything. But the only thing is, we did go Galley Row and all that. But, like, there wasn't any stores at Car Eye except for, like, those few vintage stores. <laughs> we didn't even go to any Galley stores. But it's almost 5 o'clock now. So we're going to head to the restaurant and pray that the line is still not an hour. Let's see if the CD works. He hasn't put a CD in the car since he's had it for two years. It's super. <laughs> We're here. I jumped out of the car because there's a really long line. Oh my god, I think this might be all the people waiting just to get seated. But I'm pretty sure you pay and then you go up to the buffet. Gift shop downstairs. So I just read the first one. You flip this when you're done and you keep it like this when you're eating, but you, there's no tipping, which... Uh, Never been to something like this where you don't tip. No. It says, eat all the food you would like during your visit, but please do not take food out the building. Oh, this is for the furniture shop. Cool. All right, we waited about five, seven minutes in the second line, but we're going to go up and I'm going to show you guys our plate, but I'm not going to bring the camera because I can't juggle plate with my camera. I got cornbread, salad, and a New York steak, medium, catfish, roast beef, macros, and candied yams. So we're Two. I had one. They were soup brogies, and I had both. Okay, I have the steak brogies, mini tacos, fried chicken, catfish, and then salmon somewhere underneath this. But I did all meats first, and then I'm gonna go up for sides after because I'd rather fill up on this than mashed potatoes that I can get anywhere. So. Nice 
was a good Trader Joe's one today. Was it, did they say how do you want brisket? No salad because I like it. Cornbread and we're splitting a baked potato. You got cheese, pasta salad, brisket, cornbread, and salmon chowder. I'm on my third cheese on this second. I think you grab the blueberry pie, apple crisp, pumpkin cinnamon roll, a strawberry cake, a chocolate pie, snickerdoodle cookie, and an apple dumpling. I'm a little overwhelmed. Me too. What were your outtakes from this restaurant? Delicious, all around. The meat, the sides, the salad. I mean, the soup was okay. <laughs> but everything else, outstanding. I, I loved it. Better come in for my birthday because you get a free meal. Okay. And they give you a 20% discount too, as well. For your next, for your next meal. Oh, uh, but it was definitely worth it. I just like couldn't answer. believe the amount of people. Like, I know it's a Saturday, but like. Saturday night, yeah. You could have thought that they were giving out gold in there. <laughs> How many people were waiting? But it was $28, and then it was like a service fee so I'm assuming that's what it was a tip so it came to 66 or 60 I, I don't care mm -hmm. I don't remember but I thought it was worth it like it basically 30 bucks per person like after tax and all that and with the amount of food you can get you can make up for it like I had three and a half plates plus half desserts yeah I just feel like it reminds me of Cracker Barrel like if you're familiar with Cracker Barrel it's like that the lady in front of us said it's like Cracker Barrel but on steroids like the store remind me of Cracker Barrel so much but it was three times the size of a Cracker you could, Barrel you could honestly get you spent a good hour down there and get lost in the basement yeah, like I bet you people can go there and just shop around just to shop around like and they also have a farmer's market Which is literally right around like in the parking lot like you could walk right to it But we didn't go in there because so like, I think it closed at 8 so we don't want to like rush in it And someone said that they sell some of the stuff that is in the restaurant in the restaurant You can get there like I guess cuts of meat or maybe like the sides They have them like pre-packaged that you can just get to go But maybe next time we'll check that out But I think next time we said we want to do breakfast yeah, because dinner and lunch is the same menu. Oh, it is? I yeah. thought it was a little different. Or just made price different. Price different, that's all it is. Oh. Breakfast, I want to go. I know, because I saw the waffle machines, like, behind the people that were doing the steak, and I'm like, I could go for a waffle. <laughs> But definitely, I liked it a lot. Definitely happy. The only thing I hated was the drive here. Too much traffic. For Saturday, there was so much traffic. We left at 10 o'clock. We were supposed to get here by 12. By the time it was 11, it was still the same amount of time to get here from leaving her house. Just for being in traffic. We were in traffic minutes. for 40 minutes. It was awful. So happy we came. Had the Central Market, walking around. My CDs I bought. I know. We were listening to it on the way to the restaurant, and it went by so fast. But I had a good day today. Did you enjoy it's your so first cool. time? Or, well, it's both our first time walking around Lancaster. This drive is be painful because I just want to sleep. I have the meat sweats. I'm just, I just want to go. I know. I'm like hot, tired. And I'm going to blast some Disney music Full. to keep me awake. Mm -hmm.